Hey man, what's good? It's your boy Cartier B, and today I'm about to be putting you boys on how to lace your new school vans, man. So if you guys just got a pair of new school vans or you guys are thinking about copying them, then either way, this is the perfect video for you. I'm saying the laces go a long way. Obviously, I can't show y'all boys how to lace these bands, new schools, unless obviously I lace one of them. I guess I have to untie one of them. Now, there we go. This is exactly how it will come out of the box. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, the tongue's gonna be pushed down, which I would recommend to actually, okay, we'll get into that. But boom, pretty much I'm gonna be turning this into this right here. So let's just get straight into it. Um, obviously you guys are gonna want to pull out the laces uh, match them up man You got to make sure that they're the same length so that these both hang the same way um, Now at the end you actually do have an option to not loose lace these personally I feel like it's the toughest way to rock these but at the end of the day It's your shoes. So it's up to you um, But I will be giving y'all boys the option so pretty much just go ID pull them out tight and make sure that they're lined up to the same length now these actually are are because I already had them laced um, and straight out of box straight off a of rip they should already be lined up decently like perfect and if they're not then well you just got an unlucky pair out of the batch but boom once you have these both hanging out pretty much push down the tongue because it is so like big bro there's no way that you're gonna be able to go through these holes with this sticking up so you got to push this down for the time being it will come back up trust me but it just makes it 10 times easier so yeah i think i need to find a different angle for y'all so that i can show y'all how to do this all right so boom now that we do got them on the ground hopefully this is a good angle for y'all let me check yeah y'all can see it okay cool so boom now that we have this this you know what i'm saying chilling we're gonna want to pull these laces out right here um now i'm going to actually take the left side um your guys is right i think but i'm going to take a side and pick to do this one first now just trust me on this you're going to want to go underneath first into the next hole so just like this right here now make sure that the laces do stay flat um just so it's not crooked <laughs> you feel me so boom we got that now we're gonna come over here and do the literally the same exact thing um just on the other side but don't skip through this video because we're not going underneath the whole entire time like i ain't gonna lie if y'all want to get this right you guys definitely have to watch this all the way through and i'm not just saying that because it helps me out but it does also help me out so y'all boys help me out you feel me but boom now we're gonna go over which gives it that kind of like wrapped up almost like mummy look you feel me um but boom let's see how this looks now i'll actually keep the other shoe right here just so y'all can see like how it's gonna come out um but boom we have one over now let's just keep this to the side just so it's not on our way and then we're gonna go over it again into the next hole just like this right here obviously just pull that through um make sure that it's flat again and then boom so we got some of it laced up now now it's where it gets kind of repetitive i guess um you're just gonna want to come oh yeah so there's actually this little tab right here which i forgot about but we got to go through this so how we're gonna do that is we're gonna actually take the lace right here and um put it through this this hole this thing and then we're gonna stick it through pause bro. Right, bro. okay so boom we got that through now we're gonna want to come and go back over like you feel me boom just like that so boom now we got one one of them done now we got to do the same thing um this way so we're gonna come over this other one um we just gotta get that through there and i'll be relacing every single one of my shoes and i pretty much use this same method because it's just so perfect i'm not gonna lie it works for like every shoe 
and it like gives it that lace that I want which goes a long way trust me bro y'all start relacing your sneakers don't be just having the default laces on them bro see so it started getting like crooked so just like twist it and just you know what i'm saying get it right and you can also adjust it afterwards because y'all y'all will see how it goes i'll show y'all after so boom now we got it through this little whole thing right here so we got this okay cool now we need now we need the rest okay I don't know if this is gonna be time lapse because it's actually a bunch of different steps. But for this one, you're gonna just want to go back over it um, again into this hole, the next hole, the third one down. So this one right here, uh, right here, and then boom, go like D, put it through the next one. Now I'm not gonna lie. You do the same exact thing on the other side with the same exact hole. So boom, put it through the other one. Now's where it gets a little bit like tricky, I guess. Not really tricky, but like, I mean, y'all will get it. I mean, it's honestly, so you go underneath this time. So right here, hopefully this is a good angle. You have this one right here, and then you're gonna wanna stick it underneath. Not, we don't use the top, we never use the top holes. Rules of thumb, bro never use the top holes y'all can see the pine greens right here bro we don't use the top holes we let the top holes go bro don't use them it's, we're not using that but we stick it through this one right here and then boom we do the same thing and we we don't go underneath we we just i mean we don't go over it like this we go through it if that makes sense so boom now we have it kind of laced up somewhat but now we got to adjust it so pretty much what you're going to want to do is you can put it on foot to adjust it like to your foot size which is actually a great idea that's what i'm about to do right now Go on. so boom slip slip it on foot and as y'all can see it's almost done but let's be real it's not done so okay cool now you're just going to want to grab each ends of them and like see how this one's sticking out this one right here is connected to this so what i'm gonna want to do is pull start pulling them and then find out which one is connected to this okay so right here so boom we did that and we go here and we just kind of like tighten it and one thing that i do like to do if you're loose lacing them so this is how you loose lace them if you don't want to pretty much you're just going to want to tighten it up and then uh do the little bow or however you want to do it personally bro trust me the loose lace is like the best method for these it makes them look like a hundred times tougher in my opinion so boom now we have this extra loose hanging out here but we have them loose lace at the lace at the like the length that we want them so they're not dragging on the floor um and now we have this extra to adjust so i had to pull that in right there and um just go to the next one down is how you're gonna pull that up so boom boom and then pretty much just go back and forth and just adjust it for real like just keep on going back and forth until you have it at like the length that you want it's not like too much extra this is how it is cool so we did it man no cap um if y'all boys have any extra questions let me know down in the comment sections below cardier b i'm signing out i'm gonna catch you boys in the next video no peeny knee um let me know what other videos you guys want down below man make sure y'all get flea today and have a productive day but if you're bored watch some more cardier <laughs>